back to my channel so today I'm doing a cut crease tutorial so I'm doing the look that's on my eyes right now this look is perfect for going out that's what I'm using it for I'm pairing it with a pretty basic outfit so I've got some elaborate stuff going on on my eyes so. oh and just an FYI I do not show my foundation or lips in the video just because it takes a lot of time and it's kind of repetitive if you guys want to see my foundation highlight and contour routine i'll link it down below in the description box um also i'm wearing tool by ColourPop on my lips with a little dab of kylie's pop and gloss over top to give it a little gold shimmer so let's get into the eye makeup tutorial First things first, I'm priming my eyes with an LA Girl Pro concealer and just blending it out with my finger. Then I'm taking my Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm just going to pat that all over. I just want to really prime my eyes, have a dry base for my shadow. Today I'm working with Morphe's 350M palette and I will post pictures of where the shadows are in the palette attached but I'm just taking this little reddish brown shade and I'm outlining my crease and then dragging it out a little bit so it looks like a wing. Next I'm taking a super fluffy blending brush and I'm just going to blend that out so it's not such a harsh line. Next I'm going in with this kind of darkish reddish color and I'm just putting that right over where I put that brown color and then I'm blending it out again just to mix those shades together. Next I'm going back in with that first brownish shade and it might seem a little repetitive but I didn't want to give you guys kind of a false sense of how I do it so I do go back in with that color and then just blend 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 it out. brown shade and the little swatch I put doesn't really do it justice um, for how deep of a brown it is but it is pretty deep and I'm just putting that in the crease and I'm not really dragging that out too much I just want that in the actual crease and I'm gonna blend it out believe it or not dancing does help you blend flawlessly you're super relaxed and you is just going so y'all should try it <laughs> and if dancing doesn't help wine will definitely have you feeling relaxed I mean if you're 21 of course. Next I'm taking NYX's Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Milk and if you've been with my channel for at least a little bit you know I love this thing. It is great especially for women of color or if you just have discolored eyelids to just really get the true color of the shadow you're putting on. So what I'm doing is lining out my crease, shaping it out and I'm going to put a shadow over that to get that crisp clean cut crease. Next I'm taking a lighter beige shade and I'm just going over where I just put that milk eye pencil and patting it down onto the lid. Next I'm taking NYX's Glam Liner and I'm just lining over where the two colors meet at that clean cut crease. Then I'm going in with my black gel liner. This one's by Benefit and I love this one because it's pretty easy to use especially for a gel and the tip is already kind of pre-shaped for you to get that flawless line. 
A great step that I do whenever I do liner is just take my concealer and just go right under it to make it look as flawless as possible. Then I just add lashes and put on some mascara to blend. And make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Here is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this little cut crease tutorial. And I hope it's very beginner friendly. If you guys really like this video, give it a thumbs up and let me know what you guys want to see next.